Hello everyone, right now is January 16, 2019, 9.16 p.m. here in New York City. So, the market has been rallying quite strongly with almost no pullbacks for the last three and a half weeks. So, the question on everyone's mind is, is the market due for a correction, a pullback, or is the market going to go continuing higher? So, let's pull up... Uh, SPY Spider S&P 500 ETF weekly chart right away we see there's a purple line on the chart this purple line is very important it can act both as support or resistance so go to point A back in November 2nd 2018 the market SPY actually touched the purple power line a little bit but it could not close below it as a result the market bounced right back and spend the next month and a half in the trading range until December 14, 2018. Point B, it closed below the power, the purple power line. Then the next week right after that, the market had the biggest drop in about 70 years. Okay? But ever since then, the market's been going back up strongly. So we have four weekly green up candlestick charts. But now as a result of this week's trading action, the market is now heading, reaching another purple line now. So, right now, is it possible, given the current actions, the level is there now, could be a potential turning around points for this market. Next, let's go look at sentiments. We are right now looking at VIX, which is the CBOE volatility index also known as the fear index right now we're looking at a weekly chart so the way vix works is opposite to a uh, spiders spy so when spy been going up vix will be going down because when the market goes up people's fears subside so fears gets less it goes down on the other hand when the market's been going down sharply VIX will go up because people's fear would go up. So we're right now we're looking at a weekly chart. Again, you'll notice the uh, purple power line. It acts uh, either as a strong support or strong resistance. So interestingly, now look at it. Since the end of last week, VIX on the weekly chart, it did touch the purple line. Okay, but it could not close below it. And this week, right now of Wednesday, it actually tried to bounce off it. So, here's telling us something very interesting. Even though for the past week and a half of trading, markets has been going up, S and P's been going up, but the fear index hasn't really dropped below the support level. So this is a very strong indica indication telling us that what we're experiencing right now is, you know, more of a strong bear market rally rather than a v-shaped recovery okay let's go to the daily chart on the daily chart okay right now we're looking at the vix daily chart look at it we look, look at the uh, one in the yellow rectangular box this is last two days including today's trading action yesterday it's actually almost have a doji okay that's kind of like close and uh, opening price almost the same price but slightly to the upside but today however the VIX actually closed near the end, near the high, during the end. So that's why this is a strong um, up green candle. And if you look at the uh, VIX index, this is a daily chart, since December 26, we had nothing but red candle. So that means the fear is being subsiding as the market been going up. However, since yesterday, yesterday is kind of like um, um, break even, a push, okay? But today, even though the market closed up higher, okay, but the fears have been going up. So that means people on the trading floor or people doing actively investing and trading, they are actually buying protection. They are actually saying to us that this could be a possible reversal point now. Okay, next. Let's look at TVIX. TVIX is the double leverage VIX short term volatility ETF. 
we cannot trade the VIX directly. So we have to trade these uh, ETF. And um, right now there are four ETFs that are most liquid in the volatility ETF that I would suggest that if you're going to trade at all, I suggest you trade them. They are TVIX, UVXY, VXX, and SVXY. So look at it. This chart is very similar to VIX. Uh, for this chart, since December 27, that's where the line is, the TVIX, TVIX has been going pretty much straight down with only one uh, green candle. So that shows that on this entire move up, there is no fear in the market except today. Today, the TVIX actually opened at lower low, but throughout the day, it's been going up. So that means even though today, as the market has been going up, the fear has been building among the traders. People are buying protections. They are anticipating the market might be going down. So from the sentiment wise, this is where we stand. So basically, to recap, the market has been rallying rather strongly for the past three and a half weeks. But right now, it's reaching its first sign of possible reversal point. And if right now it can close and break above the purple line, right now we're looking at S&P again strongly, then it can continue higher. But more likely than not, we are headed for a reversal. Okay, so um, we'll see how the market is going to end it up. And until next time, remember, trade with discipline. And I will see you all in the next episode. Goodbye.